ASMR time, baby. Cryogenic systems disengaging. saturation and neural activity are stable good you're right on track we'll keep monitoring though just to be sure you're adjusting well before we continue i need to install a temporary arc reactor it's a crucial part of your recovery after long periods of stasis the arc reactor will regulate your body's energy levels and help restore balance. It's a design from Mr. Stark himself. This won't hurt at all. Just a small procedure to ensure your body stabilizes after cryosleep. There we go. The arc reactor is in place and I'm seeing all your systems responding well. This will help boost your recovery and ensure everything's balanced. Let me check your vitals now that it is installed. Heart rate is stable. Breathing looks good, and your arc reactor is functioning perfectly. Your body really is adjusting well to the stasis release. There, your suit's pressure and temperature systems are reconfiguring as they should. Alright, let's bring in a second opinion. Helix, initiate diagnostics. I am Helix. Healthcare expertise and assistance for life support and intelligent examination. I'm here to ensure your well-being during your recovery. It's one of Mr. Stark's advanced AI systems, designed specifically for post-cryo care. It offers detailed analytics and support, ensuring you're recovering safely and comfortably. Commencing diagnostics for cryogenic recovery protocols. Please remain still as I gather additional data. Everything is looking great. Preparing to initiate hydration support and muscle recovery protocols to enhance your comfort. Excellent. 
excellent. With Helix's help, we'll have you feeling back to your full self in no time. Now, I'll check your cognitive responses. Follow this light with your eyes, alright? Your visual tracking is functioning well. Let's check your hearing. Can you hear that? Excellent. Your auditory functions are responding perfectly. You're doing great. Now I need you to move your fingers for me. Can you squeeze my hand? Very good. Your muscle response is normal. And there are no signs of cryostiffness. You're adjusting very well. As you transition from cryosleep, your skin might feel a bit different. Cryogenic stasis tends to leave some small effects, like tiny ice crystals and residual cryofluid. Don't worry, these are completely normal. I'll take care of them for you to ensure a comfortable recovery. Let's start with the ice crystals. They are very small but can cause sensitivity if left too long. a little cluster of crystals near your temples. I'll gently brush those away. And another small area on your cheeks. Relax. This is a routine part of cryo-recovery. These crystals form from the cooling process in cryosleep, creating a thin layer of frost on the skin's surface. But rest assured, I'm clearing them all away. go. All the crystals are gone now. That should feel much better. Now, let's address the cryofluid. To keep you preserved in cryo, a special fluid was applied protect your skin. I'll carefully remove it now, starting here along your cheeks. The fluid can sometimes cause slight dryness if left on for too long. So, I want to make 
skin is already looking clearer and healthier without the fluid but there's one last step to ensure you feel completely refreshed I'm applying a special hydrating mist now this formula was developed by Mr. Stark's team specifically for cryo recovery it rehydrates and balances your skin, helping it adapt to normal conditions. You might feel a cool, soothing sensation as it absorbs. There we go. Just a bit more to cover every area. The mist is made with advanced nano hydrators. It will seep into the skin and bring back elasticity, leaving it feeling soft and replenished. It is absorbing beautifully. Your skin already looks way better. I will monitor you closely, but this treatment should keep your skin hydrated and comfortable as you adjust to post cryo conditions. That's it. All done. The ice crystals are cleared away. The cryofluid is removed. You should feel much more at ease. If there's any discomfort, I am here to assist. You are probably wondering why you were placed into cryosleep. Earth 616, our home, was devastated. A multiversal war caused immense destruction across realities and our Earth couldn't survive the incursion. We are traveling to a new planet, Xeon 9, located in a nearby galaxy. It is habitable and offers a chance to rebuild. Mr. Stark's drones and I were sent to ensure our safe journey and well-being as we start this new chapter. Everything looks good. Your vitals are stable. Your cognitive and motor functions are normal. And your skin, well, you took care of that. You're recovering so good. And we'll be arriving at our destination tomorrow. You can rest now. I'll be 
watching over you throughout the night to ensure everything remains stable. Until then, just relax and get some sleep. Good night. I'll be here if you need me. Sleep well and I'll wake you when we arrive. It looks like the frost built up nicely during our sleep. Just a gentle sign of deep rest. Exactly as planned. Let's clear a little window here, so when you fully wake, you'll see the stars. They are beautiful today, even from this far out. This frost is a good sign, means the temperature held steady while we drifted through the outer region. Just removing a few of these ice crystals. Each one has kept you shielded while the ship navigated silently onward. Earth, it feels so far away now. You've been traveling longer than it seems.
です。